Welcome back, guys. Uh, I'm biting the bullet. Um, I've been looking at the map, right, and we've got a map edge here. So I reckon the other map edge is kind of somewhere, I don't know, kind of somewhere over here-ish, probably, along here. Which makes that probably kind of about in the middle. And I'm, like, looking at this now, I'm thinking that this is going to be, like, pretty central in the map. So I'm going to relocate. And this is going to be our main base. And I'm going to... I think I'm going to end up doing a mega base because I'm really, really enjoying this series. Like, I'm really, really enjoying this. And I want to do the whole, you know, uh, wooden flooring and cobblestones and docks and all kinds of stuff. Like, properly, formally laid out and really nice. Um, but just before I make a final decision, I'm going to go on one quick voyage. So what I'm going to do, I am going to, uh, let's see, what am I going to get rid of? Uh, I'm not going to take the life jacket. I am going to take that. I'm not, uh, am I going to, I'm going to take the pig skins. I'm going to take that. I'm going to take the charcoal. Those can go up there. Uh, I'll just take two stacks of logs. Uh, anything else that I want to take with me? Uh, the rest of the stuff I'll come back for. Uh, gears. Gears would kind of be the only thing. And you know what? I'm going to take the spyglass. Okay, you know what? We're, we're, I'm going to grab the food. Or at least I'm going to uh, I'm going to eat that stale meatballs. Because it's going to go rotten. I'm going to grab half the food. And I'm going. We're going. That's it. Now, I do realise... Oh, no. There's something else I want. There's something else I want. And that's... Uh, coral and sand. Coral and sand for a chimney. Uh, what I'm going to do... Uh, where's the coral and sand? Uh, okay. Coral and sand. Grab the coral. Grab the sand. Make two limestone. Uh, which, of course, I haven't got room for. Put that back for a second. Uh second limestone okay and then can I prototype a chimney yes I can prototype that good then I can put the sand back and put the coral back right cool my god I actually remembered to do something oh <laughs> how much gold do we have it's a very very good point uh, we've only got four gold we're going to need gold. We are going to need gold at the new place. Okay. Now, I, I am aware that I'm leaving my chef's pouch behind. Oh, but I'm not leaving my crock pot behind. The chef's pouch I'll leave behind, but the crock pot, no. So, where the hell's the boat? <laughs> oh, it's up there. Right. Uh, and what we're going to do is to kind of ensure that that island really is like pretty central we're going to sail off the edge of this map and back on the other side and see what it looks like you know what let's put on the captain's hat and increase the durability of the boat that's got to be a reasonably good idea oh there's a, what's that oh a cargo boat oh yeah not really worth it get back over here oh sharks okay well now we're kind of committed to sailing off the edge of the map because I really don't want to stop and try and have a fight with them especially without a sail so yep uh, I probably want to go more down to get to the map edge quicker I sailed straight through that wave Okay. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, Wally. Right, let's get into the get into the fog. So we lose the sharks, which is a good thing. Come on. Zone me in. Here we go. Right. Now let's find out where on earth we are. So Ooh, we're right up there. 
Yeah, you know, that is, if you think about it, the map edge there, map edge there. So the center line is about like there. So it runs through that island. And then if you've got map edge there, you can have a map edge somewhere over here. That is pretty damn central. And since we're going to have to explore all of this, I think that's a much better place to be than over here, don't you? Well, hell yeah. I mean, we'll still keep probably a mini base over there. Just for like convenience, but we'll, I think we'll strip most of it and ship it over here. Well, okay, we we need to get over here then. It's either that or go back, but I don't think there's any point doing that. So uh, let's head in this general direction. And of course, the waves are against me because because they would be. Oh man. I've got to be more careful and not hit waves because I'm going to damage my sanity. Now, I could equip a pirate hat. Let's do that. And that gives me increased visibility as well. And that is a very good thing. See, I think the, I think the captain's hat should give you increased visibility as well. But I suppose, you know, you've got the sanity... Well, because you've got the sanity bonus with the with the pirate's hat. I mean, shouldn't the captain's hat give you good bonuses as well? I, th I think the captain's hat should definitely, definitely give you an uh, increased uh, visual range. Um, I would normally stop and search this coral... But because it's late at night and I'm trying to get to land, I'm not going to. And the reason I would search it is because I'm looking for Yarktopus. And he's in one of those coral, coral farms. Um, I think we're just going to have to keep going for now. Now, what I could do, I could equip the spyglass and like... Uh, well, well, let's get out of the way. Um... Oh, what the hell. Spyglass. Now, where are we? Uh, okay. So, spyglass. Why can't I use the spyglass? Slippery spyglass. Okay, whatever. Never mind. Uh, torch, and let's make a boat torch. Because that one's not going to last very long. Let's put it up there. Okay, and we'll keep going. We'll keep... So yeah, oh, God, I've hit another wave, damn it. I'm just looking over here, because it looks like there might possibly be some land over here. Let's equip that. Okay, good. Why can't I use that spyglass? That's kind of weird. Equip it. Okay. Weird. Uh, we've got a, ra we've got a raft over there in the middle of the ocean. This is shallower water over here. What the hell's this over here? Sailing this direction a little bit. We'll find out. Uh, no, it was just the uh, just the edge of that. I think we'll go over here and see if we can actually find some land. <laughs> Wouldn't be a bad idea at the moment find some land. My situation appears very grim. Yeah, you're not kidding. Let's have a look at the map. Oh, here we go. Here we go. And unless I'm very much mistaken, that's a rock biome. Yeah, it is. Okay, well, that's good news. It's almost daylight. Um, huh. Okay, you know what? We're going to get some gold, guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're going to mine some gold. Uh, put... Let's put the... Here up there. I'm probably going to end up ditching some of these tools. We're almost there. 
I suppose I should actually sail around here because I'm going to be heading in this direction eventually. I might as well have the boat over here. Uh, I'm going to let the boat torch run out because it's low anyway. Okay, uh, let's... Now what? Why, why the hell? Oh, See, now I can peer. Why couldn't I peer when I was on there? Oh, and now I can. Okay, well that's very, very strange because I couldn't before. And I was right clicking. Yes, I was right clicking before anybody says anything. That's weird. That was very, very weird. Um, okay, let's equip the shovel and let's get digging. Oh, gold. That's what we want. Oh, more gold. I'll grab the flint before we dig the last bit out because it's bound to explode. And a rock over there. Okay, let's get let's get loads and loads of gold. Oh, I'll grab the flint before it blows up. Because it's bound to. Oh no, it didn't. Wait, it didn't give me any gold. What the hell? Let's work from this side, I think. Oh, gold. Grab that. What are we up to? Three gold. We are gonna need. I'm thinking quite a lot of gold. Because uh, we've got to do like we've got to do pretty much everything from scratch. So yeah, we're gonna need a fair amount of gold. Uh, I'm just looking to see if any gold gold got blown up. I didn't see a gold nugget, but it's always worth a little bit of a look around. Oh, okay, come on, come on, give me gold, give me gold. Nope, it's not going to give me gold. Shovel. Oh, and we blew up again. God, some of the, the stuff travels a very long way. It's like it just gets thrown up into the air, you never see it again. Oh man, still no gold. Loads of flint, but no gold. And they are gold piles. You think you should be guaranteed some, don't you? And there's reeds over here. We've got a marsh biome. That would have been... Oh, hang on. We've got a gem. What's that? Blue gem. Yeah, well... Oh, gold. Yes, excellent. Uh, any more gold piles over here? Nope, yeah, there's one. Cool. So, um, we're in the middle of day 44 digging for victory uh, and not finding any blooming gold in gold piles this game's mean to me I think oh there we go there's one Let's grab that. and then it blows up I take damage and no gold nuggets Let's do this part of this there's fortunately there's lots of piles of gold. Piles of gold, rich but uncomfortable. <laughs> Kids ask your parents. Right, uh, how are we doing? I better eat a bacon and eggs before I manage to kill myself. Let's have this. Um, I am soaking wet now, which is a potentially a big problem. I didn't bring my umbrella. Of course I didn't. And there was a gold nugget that just got blown up into the air. Where the hell did it go? Oh, it probably went a hell of a long way. God damn. Look, I'm completely soaked. Now, oh, there's a gold nugget. Pick it up before it gets blown into the stratosphere. That's another one there. And, yeah, everything is slipped. It certainly is. Okay. Uh, yeah, there's still plenty of evening left, so we can carry on digging. What are we up to? Eleven. I'm going to need more than that. Um, I, I mean, I'm thinking, like, we probably need, like, a stack of gold. Oh. We got blown up in the air, and we never see any of it again. Great. Uh, what about over here? Yeah, there's a pile there. Let's dig this puppy up. Uh, oh, blue gem. 
No, I don't want the blue gem because I can't carry it. Oh, gold. The only problem is that with this is the insanity. Oh, did that break? I think that broke. Let's grab a shovel. Oh. Yeah. Look at my sanity. <laughs> We've got 13 gold. Which um, I guess the game is now telling me is an unlucky number. I would love to get like, a bit more. Come on. No. No, and now this monster's going to be chasing me around. And of course it's almost night time. Come on. Oh, no. Get your shovel. Ow. Oh, move. Oh. Yeah, there's gold there. Should be able to just pick it up. There we go. Right, okay. Where's the boat? The boat's over here. So I think we're just going to jump on the boat. And go. Although, you know what? Because we've got flames from these things, maybe we should ride out the night where we are. I mean, it might... No, no, of course not. Let's make a torch. Oh! I just dropped it. God damn. Yeah, come over here. Because I want to come back over here and grab that torch. Oh! Damn. Let's go back over here. And oh, well, we're halfway through the night anyway. Uh, I don't. Uh, whoops, I didn't want to do that. Uh, just in time. I think I went too far. Oh, yeah, I don't want to be on the marsh biome in the middle of the night. That would not be good. Um, there's my boat. I guess I could drop the shovel. Do without it. Um, do we just get in the boat and go? I think maybe we do. My situation appears very grim. Yeah, you're not kidding, pal. We, the thing is, we can't go anywhere because we're holding the torch. So we kind of just got to wait. Let's um, eat some food. That gives me five sanity back. But my sanity's still dropping because it's night time. Right, now it's daytime. Okay, where are we up to? We're day 45. We've managed to stay alive. We've got a stack of gold. So now we can just head over to this island. And we're in a really really good position to set up camp. We're going to have everything that we want here. We've got a stack of gold. So, yeah. I'm thinking we're in, I'm thinking we're in good shape. Come back for the next one, guys. Peace out.